To this day, I believe the 1922 silent film Nosferatu presents the most terrifying portrayal of Count Dracula. But is it Count Dracula? Sure, the name changing to Count Orlok and the setting moving to Germany in 1838 helped deflect some copyright infringement. But when Florence Balcom, Bram Stoker's widow and literary executor, heard of the film and its plot, she lost hers. Florence won her legal dispute with Nosferatu's producers and demanded that all copies of the film should be destroyed. She never received financial reparations as the German film studio Prana Film declared bankruptcy. Nosferatu lay dead in its own ashes. Until 1929, when copies of the film started to resurface with screenings in New York City, Max Schreck's portrayal had returned from the dead. To explore the Nosferatu oeuvre further, watch The Shadow of the Vampire and reportedly, which director Robert Eggers is looking to remake the film with Bill Skarsgård as the Count.